Surprising. This update has many surprises, and I don't even know where to... Like, it, it, dude, it surprises me every day, okay? This is what I'm saying, all right? So from everything, all the secrets, the energy secret... There, okay, guys, something's going on in Brookhaven, all right? Who is this lady here? She keeps following me, dude. Stop. Who are you? Nah, 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 nah. Just stop following me, okay? <laughs> dude, she's not gonna stop following me, dude. I'm getting out of here. I'm teleporting over here, dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna relax on this lawn chair here. Ain't nobody gonna know. Ain't nobody gonna know. Anyways, guys. Yeah, so this update is not to be played with. It reveals pretty much, honestly, borderline almost everything we need to understand this full energy update and what this energy source is they're using. Look at that. She's creeping over there now, dude. What is this person? I don't know. Hopefully, she doesn't see me. Oh, no, dude. She's spotting me. I got a stalker, dude. Just don't move. Just don't move. And she, she's going door to door. Don't move. Don't move. I don't think she sees me. I think we're safe. I think we're 100% safe. Oh, no, dude. Oh, no, dude. Run. <laughs> Stop. Dude, this is a dude. I don't, I don't know what to do, guys. But before we dive too far into this video and uh, continue getting stalked here, um, be sure to hit that like button, guys. Let's get a lot of likes for the sake of the community so this video can get out there more and people can understand the full mystery, the full Operation Redriver, the, the energy source they're working with, how history is going to show us the way, um, how all this stuff is being managed, and go completely in-depth with how... This is all going to come around. This is a big video, uh, and I just believe that I can't even begin to, like, we, we got to get this rolling because there's a lot to talk about, dude. And uh, go get your Rosie Shoulder Pet, all that good stuff. Guys, oh my God, dude, I totally forgot already, guys, uh, in my introduction there. Uh, before we get too far into this, guys, we do got merch now, ongmerch.com. Links will be in the description if you guys want to go get you some Rosie uh, items in real life. It's pretty cool. Anyways, enough with all that mumbo jumbo. Let's get on to the main purpose of this here, guys. And I feel like this lady is not going to leave me alone she is following me i don't even know if it's a subscriber or who it is or someone I'm, I'm in a random lobby so like who what do you want <laughs> let me let me just ask what do you want what do you want <laughs> please what do you want explain yourself okay wait don't no, get stop explain oh my god dude <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. She's, she's creeping me out, dude. All right. Well, we're going to have to deal with her throughout this whole process. Anyways, guys. So... Uh, basically, the new house kind of revealed a lot of creepy stuff to us, but it wasn't the main direction of this update, guys. The new house wasn't the thing that was going to show us all the secrets. The church is where you're going to find all the secrets in this update, including the energy source, how the energy source works and operates, and I'm going to be showing you guys finally what the weird pyramids do and what they are and everything regarding them as well. <laughs> so yeah, let's... uh, Dude, here she goes again. All right, let her be. Um, All right, so... Basically, let's go get us a house somewhere. Vacant lot 11 will do just fine. Boom. We're going to go get that new house. Actually, everyone has that new house in the neighborhood. I should probably get that other new house so I can show you guys what I'm talking about. This this one here, right? With the solar panels on the roof. I think it's that one, dude. I hope it's that one. We're going to go with that and hope that, that that is the right house that I need. I believe it is. All right. So the reason why I'm picking this house first is because it, it is very important that I explain to you guys about this whole energy uh, message decoding that we're trying to do and everything of sorts. So let's go in here and actually go review this for the people that uh, don't know what I'm talking about. So if you go up here in this house, we got this in one of the previous updates. There's this weird totem like thing with a pyramid on the top electricity running through it as if it's a form of electricity some form of power being conducted and used here as we know operation redriver was can uh working around a energy source a a, a, a gravitational uh teleporting like i mean the, the agency is working on some crazy stuff here that is way beyond our comprehension right so they're working on a whole new energy source and this kind of implies further into that we have the pyramid here and then we have another small pyramid here that is uh, blanked out that probably says energy or kinetic or something like that dude i don't know you could be the translation of that as you want but this we finally get to see how this weird energy pyramid works and i'm going to be showing you guys fully functionable how it works uh i probably should have recruited one of you guys for this but i'll just go over and explain it so we have that which is quite interesting but now we actually know how it works so if we go into zoe's house here maybe i can show you guys the weird secrets in this house nope she's got the house locked all right people like their houses in brookhaven now let me get on the bike here go over here Oh my god, dude, slow. I'd rather run. Alright, so maybe I can go in one of their houses. I'm sure someone's got it unlocked. Uh, yeah, perfect. Alright, so let's go down in here 
and squeeze on over here go into the secret room now everybody's making videos like oh look at a secret room dude we've been known of this secret room guys okay we've been known of that um so we know we got the weird symbol here i kind of went over and talked about this in my time travel secret video about this the this this strange symbol that the agency is using and let me go ahead and show you what i mean here a little bit brighter but yeah there's a strange cross-like resembling symbol that the agency is using for all their weird energy uh, oh, dude, no, dude. <laughs> oh, man, darn it, dude. All right, let's try to go in Ginger Cat Bro's house. Oh, dude, yeah, come on, man. Oh, come on, dude. Jeez, this would happen, guys. And I can't spawn another house either because of the, uh, whatchamacallit. If I spawn another house, I have to wait 10 minutes. It always ends up that way. Nope, so has her house uh, locked, so... Um, let's try the let's try her house. Uh, I'm this is the person that I was like camped out under the front. Uh, okay, perfect. All right, so as long as this person doesn't do away with their house, we might be able to get to what we want to do. Now, there are countless secret buttons, guys. The community's been finding left to right. We found a few. Uh, we found the one behind the church, and then other people have found these buttons. I know uh, what's her name, Vinny or something. She finds a lot of this stuff too. Um, all right, so let's actually look right here, guys. You see, there's one of those weird buttons right here behind the pillar in here. Now, what does those buttons usually signify or do? They're usually forms of teleportation. You click the button, you teleport to a whole unknown area. It's a pretty big deal, right? You can teleport to a whole exclusive strange area. And uh, I'm imagining that these buttons are going to be uh, able... We're going to be able to activate these buttons at one point in time. But, Wolfpack, why don't you keep giving us buttons we can't do nothing with, man? <laughs> this is happening so much, guys. We're getting so many buttons that we just don't really... We can't press, we can't do nothing with. And it's just kind of like, well, darn. So, um, let's go ahead and hop on our skateboard cut our speed to 45 here and go on over here guys into the church now this is very special here because the church is going to be the thing that shows us everything okay this is this is interesting okay so you you know you have your whole uh coffin here you turn around you can see western Brookhaven in there i made countless videos on this i did a deep dive into it on a live stream which is where we found the remainder of all this connecting so it's really weird that they decided to update the church so heavily with this time traveler here and then if you go stand in the light here and there's this light beaming up to the ceiling here okay it's beaming up there as if we can get beamed up into the light or walk through the light and go to some other dimensional type travel thing well if we look over here and we press this we pull the bell each time i'm pulling that bell it's activating an energy source that is wired in the ceiling that goes to this light source here and right above this area here is a pyramid uh one of those energy light pyramids right above here every time the bell gets pulled uh it comes over here it activates it and i'm thinking like maybe one of us ha we have to do something then we stand right here in the light and we can like be beamed up into some like special area in brookhaven that we've never seen right but um yeah and now the bell it's very important to know the bell lights up with a strong light source whenever you pull it now i don't think i can go in here and pull the bell from here which is kind of annoying because it's going to be hard to show you guys did I get it? Nope. See, the bell lights up massively with this yellow energy. Now, this is big because we're going to go in to look at it. Now, if we also look right here. No, oh, I can't see. There's a button behind the church right here, guys. And this, this, the tip of the church is actually the obelisk that's also in the new house just plastered there. It, it, it's the tip of the church. So the church has strong connections with this energy source and everything that's going on. It's really, really weird, guys. Okay, so I thought that was inter it's, it's very interesting as well because, like, okay, the this weird black obelisk-like thing was in that also creepy meeting room, right? And, um alongside with the symbols that the agency uses so we know the two are connected and uh the buttons are there the hidden buttons are there as well what do these buttons do uh also guys there's a weird rumor going on that people are seeing something appear and disappear in the stables uh from time to time i don't know what that is but that's kind of creepy when someone says like oh something appears and disappears around this time i'm like dude that's kind of creepy anyways if you guys are wondering where we're going we're going to the drones a quicker easier way to get on top of the church i mean i could try to use a ladder but it never really works out in my favor doing that but either way let's just go get the drone to make this a bit easier on ourselves, so i can start glitching to show you guys the inside of the church is attic which is where you can see the energy source and the pyramid and everything of that sort i know i've been talking about it. you guys are probably like this is just not real is it yes it is 100 percent real we're going to show you and get a closer up uh look of the button on the back of the church so i'm not quite sure what all this means or what it's bringing together but this pretty much reveals the full secret and i'm almost certain guys this is everything in the current update i just want to kind of tell you guys all secrets are right here you know that's pretty much all you're getting in this update 
Um, cause it, it usually takes about a few days after one of these updates are released for us to find everything. Uh, and then when we find everything, it's kind of like, well, we usually hit, uh, roadblocks. We don't really find nothing else till, no, well, I'm actually, I take that back. There is another thing that I, I, I found that I want to address and look over in, uh, maybe one of the next videos or so. Uh, but that's for a whole nother video and that's not directed towards the energy secret that we're dealing with here. So. Let me just jump down here. All right, guys. So if you look here, here's the button here. It's one of the weird symbols. I think this button is uh, just something like it. It's very common. You see it somewhere in Brookhaven. But yeah, uh, what you want to do is get your sleeping bag here. Okay. Now, the place in this thing perfectly is a bit challenging. I'm going to tell you. Okay. So let's actually place this thing in the best place we can. Okay. That's not bad. That's not bad. Okay. Now, here it is, folks. Here it is. Look at that. Energy pyramid source wired to the bell over there guys it's wired to the bell over there so every time the bell gets rung the energy shoots out into this light where there's like this beam of light just going down in and so i'm thinking like maybe this is how we're going to be able to time travel or travel back in time doing something with this contraption here there's this weird uh pyramid like they do i don't know i feel like this is going to be a way that we're going to be able to travel back in time do something crazy uh and this is crazy because guys i'm not seeing nobody really look too far into this to cover this for some weird reason but uh yeah guys let's take creator cam on here look at this it's pretty creepy dude it's pretty creepy I ain't gonna lie I ain't gonna lie dude but anyways um yeah guys so that's something you can play around with look around and uh that's pretty much i think i know almost everything that i wanted to talk about in today's video that covers almost all the secrets uh we found this one on stream a couple days ago i know you guys probably seen that stream but i wanted to make a whole video because i know people just don't have time to watch the full stream sometimes so that's why i'm here with the video me and rosie of course so guys don't forget that we do have real life merch now now uh we have a, a pillow a, a rosy pillow that is fantastic quality i love it uh I, I i'm personally very happy with it um we have a rosy pouch a little pouch you put your pencils in whatever else you need to store uh, maybe some important documents or are you travel something like that it's a nice little pouch to have represent rosie um and then we have and mind you the rosies on the uh, on these the, the pillow and the pouch are exclusive rosies you're not going to be able to get anywhere so we, we're kind of wanting to go with the direction of like collect all the rosies you know if you want to have all the unique rosies that you can have the pillow that it's like a full collection type thing right but we also have the normal stickers and we're going to have more coming in the future so thank you guys for buying the merch those that have and know that we're working constantly behind the scenes to give you guys the best that we can possibly do all right guys i will see you all in the next one use star code with g if you have it and have a nice day find those secrets in brooklyn